Today's episode is going to be a little different, partly because I am exhausted. I had very little sleep last night. You'll probably understand why once we get into the topic at hand. Well, you might be saying, uh, hey, Vlognosis, that's a sweet purse you got there. Uh, is there something we should know? Well, actually, there is. It's probably not what you're thinking. It's a lily. <laughs> not that at all. Uh, this is this is a Michael Kors bag, high quality leather. Why am I even talking about any of this? Well, here's why. It has been cut in half by Michael Kors, as have the other approximately 600 bags that I found last night in my dumpster dive haul. And there's clothing in here too that could be clothing people in need. Each one rather than being donated to needy people in third world countries that would have no impact on on retail sales in the United States, they just they cut them up and toss them into a landfill to destroy our environment. It's non-stop destroyed purses for days, which could have, and, and clothing, which could have benefited humanity. But no. Nope. There's another bag. Let's empty this bag out. These could have been given to villagers in third world countries to help them carry medicine and supplies, or even women's shelters. I, I would estimate there are about 600 purses in this hall, and yet not a single one of them is salvageable. You know, there's clothing in here that they could have donated, again, to people in countries that that barely have anything, that can barely even have clean drinking water. Here is one of many examples that I found in this haul. This was a perfectly good blouse until they decided to cut it in half. They didn't even try to recycle it. They just threw it in the dumpster. And then there's a dress here. You can see the Michael Kors label and what used to be the outline of a dress. They just chopped it up. Just chopped it up. There are people in this world that, I mean, these products could have changed their lives. Instead of relying on a plastic bag that's tearing at the seams, they could be using a bag like this and saving millions of, of disposable plastic bags from entering our environment. Discarded plastic bags are a huge epidemic all over the world. They destroy crops and animal lives. Also, a villager in a third world country could use a bag like this over the cores of their entire life. You wear leather clothes that will last you the rest of your life. MK could have helped the environment. They could have helped battered women's shelter. They could have helped a villager, but no. Please share this video with everyone you know. Let's work together to contact these companies and let them know that there is a better way. They can simultaneously help the environment and help society and even grow their own business. Almost everyone I know would want to buy from a company that does the right thing. Thank you for watching.